these historical individuals must be criminalized. In the same way Hitler has been criminalized, we as the Rafidah believe that the Islam of Ahlul Bayt, peace and blessings be upon them, is the absolute truth and that the path of Ahlul Bayt is that of the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings be upon them all. We reject calls of violence towards absolutely any innocent human being or any innocent being for that matter or any innocent living thing even when it comes to for example plants. If you read back, if you revise, uh, revise the Islamic history and what the Prophet peace and blessings be upon him and his family he even had words to protect, imagine, to even protect the plants, to protect the ants and he used to ban and uh, he, he used to severely, severely uh, despite people who would commit such things, who would burn the nature for example, who would uh, kill any living thing, any living being without any reason. And we also believe in peaceful coexistence with the entire world. No matter what one's creed, religion, doctrine, race, ethnicity. We wish for a society of non-violence, a society of compassion and mutual respect for all. Where a Shia community and its contrasts can engage in healthy academic dialogue with one another. Where churches, synagogues, temples and all places of worship are protected and all humans are protected and where terrorism in the name of Islam in particular has no leg to stand on for its radical ideology again we put three lines under this for its radical ideology has collapsed God willing imagine what a goal this would be for the whole world not only for the Muslims